morning. Nice to see you all. Today uh, I'm on holiday. Well, not just today, this week I'm on holiday and I'm going to uh, go and play one of the top courses in Europe. So, uh, hope you're going to enjoy this. And this, mes amis, is La Touquet. So here on the 2K there's two courses, the La, the La Mer, the sea and uh, La Forêt, the forest obviously. Uh, today we're going to play La Mer, it's constantly voted as one of the top 100 in Europe and it looks like a sort of a cross between a Heathland and a, and, and a Lynx course. It's a little bit breezy, there's a little bit of a shower in the air, but we're on holiday we're going to enjoy it. Saying the beautiful par three. Just played that one. I'll not tell you what happened. And now that's the third little short par four over this valley. Them pretty typical links. I've just hit a shot on here that got pretty much up to the hole. Just a bit of spin, it was a 9 iron, and it's come all the way back down to the bottom of the bank. Not up, really. This is where it's pitched, maybe not quite as close as I thought. Certainly needed one more club. That's what I've got left. Pretty steep. Certain beauty to courses like this, I think it's always nice when it's cut out of the dunes, um, a bit like Knott's Golf Hollingwell, that's a little bit like this in places. Uh, Formby, which is another one of my favourites up in the sort of northwest of England. Um, and now with this little bit of weather and uh, a bit of a breeze as well, showing its teeth. yard from where I am today. Um, we've had a um, funny round so far, got off to a bit of a shaky start, I put that down to early morning and no warm-up uh, and then just last two holes and a bit of a mess with them two as well but they were tough ones that you need to know a little bit so we'll see if we can do any better this night. So 
I play quite a lot of golf in France. Uh, I've never played a golf course like this. I've played much more sort of forest courses, maybe a bit more like the other courses, like having walked through it to get to this one. Uh, and I didn't really know what to expect with this. I wondered whether it'd be a little bit more like the um, Yas Links in Abu Dhabi, where it's like a modern links course, but this is really traditional. It's, it, it is almost 100 years old, or 80 years old, 90 years old, something like that. And you can tell that it's been here a long time, the way that it's been put together. Golf snacks are different gravy around here as well. The last couple of holes and these next couple of holes are new and you can tell that it's much flatter around here. I feel like the sea is just the other side of those trees over there. It's one of the old pillboxes on top of the hill there. Some of this course was, in fact all the course was closed during the war and then reopened, uh, it was designed in 39, I just read a plaque, it's just a couple of teeth back. the last this tea gives you that view there's the sea it looks a bit cloudy and a bit wet today that was the 2k out there today and next time I'll have to bring some friends it'll be even more fun uh, and hopefully the weather might be a little bit better. Uh, off to the beach now and also probably gonna have some cheese because I've had me for about 12 hours. Thanks for watching, see you again soon.